Hey guys, what's up? Today I'm going to be showing you how to port forward on the TELUS VSG1432. First thing you're going to need to do is open up your command prompt. So type CMD in your search. For Windows 8 it would be in the corner and then search. Now you're going to type in ipconfig and click enter. Scroll up and find your IPv4 address and your default gateway. Minimize your command prompt and open up your browser. Make sure it's not on Google how it was for mine. And type in your default gateway. I already have mine memorized. When you type it in, it would bring you up to like this page. It would start loading loads your default username should be admin and your password should be defaultly be telus go to network settings and click NAT now since you're here it's gonna be empty click add new rule make sure you click active minecraft you can put any name you want for it but since I've been making a Minecraft server, I'm naming it Minecraft. You can name it like Minecraft server or like your name, Minecraft server, anything you want basically there. Type 25565, 25565, 25565, all for all of them. Leave TCP there and go back to your command prompt. Look at your IPv4 address. Look at and look at the back two di digits. Make sure you remember those. I already set mine's defaultly to 69. But don't use mine, use yours, or else this will not work at all. You're still not done yet. You still need to do one more thing. Click add new rule again. Active. Name it the same thing as what you just did. Make sure you do 25565 again. And make sure you change TCP to UDP. And type in your server IP address the same thing. And click apply. There, you're done. You can exit that and you can exit your command thing your command prompt I recommend downloading the PF port checker it's really helpful this will like basically check if people can get on your server so TCP went through okay UDP it's still going see if it's still gonna work sometimes it takes a while for it to work so like tell us takes a little while so don't do it too fast like how I just did because as you can see <laughs> it just like didn't work that fast but see, now people can actually go on it if, if you know like basically you find out if nobody can get on your server if the port checker result is red that means something's wrong I have um like basically passed it so my server should be running so I'm just gonna re reload it and I'm gonna play some Minecraft and play with my friends hope you enjoyed the video